Today we're going to take a look at an application uh, that I just recently completed and this is an application to display World Cup 2014 information. I had the idea for this app oh, a couple of days ago and so I started looking around for an official World Cup API that I could use uh, to make restful calls and then you know put together a uh, you know, a beautiful application using Alpha Anywhere and our UX control to consume the JSON using our HTML templating and so on. So I couldn't find an official one, but I did find a unofficial uh, API for the World Cup at Kimono Labs, and that's actually right right behind my uh, uh, AirPlay display of my iPhone here. So. Um, that's what we're. That's where we're getting most of our data for the app. But I just wanted to show you the app, so we'll see it in action on my iPhone. This is on an iPhone 5. So what we did was we just made a call for all the teams. We made a RESTful call. We got back the JSON. We formatted it into a list control uh, in here. I'm going to go ahead and just tap on uh, um, one of the uh, countries, and in this case Belgium, and now we're going to show the match results. So when I did that, again, we made another call, uh, retrieved the JSON data uh, through the Kimono Labs API. If I go ahead and uh, I might not know where this country is, if I tap on show map, we're going to make a call out to the Google API, the Maps API, and, and show where that country is. I'm going to go ahead now and tap on players, and we're going to bring up a list of all the players. So when I tapped on that button, we made a restful call to the World Cup API, pulled this stuff up, and uh, now I'm going to go ahead and tap on a player, and I'm going to make another call to bring back all of their statistical information. And we have also made a call to Flickr. And if there were any photos available on Flickr, so using Flickr's API, a button appears at the top and uh, and if I tap on that now I can see uh, some numerous photos that may ex publicly be available on the Flickr API so in this case you know this is a good example of a mashup we are talking to three different APIs in this application we're actually never talking to an alpha server we're only making restful calls and we're consuming JSON data in the application this is a PhoneGap application, so it's a native app, and it runs on Android devices and on iOS devices. I have also built it for Windows, but I haven't been able to test it yet on a Windows device, but I don't suspect there, there would be any problems there. So the thing that's really unique about this app was I had the idea for the app a couple of days ago, wanted to put something together very quickly, and was able to do so in approximately three days. And that included studying the different APIs, figuring out how to pull off all the integration, and then of course, uh, you know, building the app and, and debugging it and getting everything working and, and laid out pretty much the way I wanted. So uh, I'm really pleased with the way it came out. And in my next video, I will show you exactly how we built this application. Thanks.